Motivation? You need motivation? What the fuck is wrong with y'all? Y'all think because I'm some type of spiritual adept that I can't really get real with you for a second? Let me rap to you, homie. Let me rap to you, shorty. Let me rap to you, fam. What kind of person do you feel like needs a certain type of motivation in this life to love themselves? A motherfucking weakling. Somebody who has no self-respect. See now, I could guide you, I could push you in the right direction, but this is stemming from all the soft stuff that I hear every day, all that soft shit that I hear every day. That if I give any type of head nod or okay to it or permission, then it goes into my subconscious and it registers within me. So at a certain level, I can no longer agree or approve of the impossible mindsets that people walk around with. Let me talk to you for a second. I'm in the business of online coaching. I give people the results. I get people to get the results that they really want out of their life. You feel me? I get so many people that tell me on a daily basis, oh, I need a, I need a trainer in person or X, Y, Z. I train people in person. And shouts out to the clients that I've trained in person because they've come from where they started to a good place, I guess relatively, but they ain't got it all together. Let's be real. In what world do you need another man to hold your hand to get you to where you need to be as a better individual? You see what I'm saying? Like, that's not a fact. You don't need an individual there. And that's the thing about me. Remind you who the fuck I am. YWY, your world is yours, Sheiky Sheik. I've been doing this two years for Dolly. Who's my cameraman? Me. Who's editing? Me. Who's coming up with the ideas and the love to pass on to the enthusiasm? Me. Right. Who did 400 push-ups in the snow by himself to transmute generational trauma and get himself free of mental pain? Me? Who freed himself? Me? Right. Now I show up every day for y'all. Who's motivating me? And you need somebody to, to, to be there to hold your hand and be the training wheels and get you to do the things that you should be doing for yourself anyway? The fuck is wrong with y'all? Yeah, and then y'all want to have it because I said I'm a spiritual adept, because I'm spiritually inclined, because I can operate from the crown chakra and I'm a mastermind, right? Level seven mastermind, let's say it like that. I'm not a master mastermind, but let me put it like that, because I can operate from the crown chakra and I prefer to operate from the crown. Y'all forget that we living on the ground. So let's keep it really real. How are we gonna get you to operate at your next level? You can't be self-starting. You need somebody to be there with you. You want somebody to hold your hand, baby? You want somebody to hold you to, oh, you got 10 reps left? That's what you need? You a fucking man. You a fucking woman. You a grown-ass adult. Grab yourself, lace, lace your shoes up, and get it out there. Get out there. Manifest the dreams. Stop waiting on other people to, to, to do the work for you. That's childish. Wipe your own ass. Tie your own shoes. Clean your own room. Make your own bed and cook your own food. Become self-sufficient. Become independent. Become a master of yourself. Everybody out here with these complaints and these false ass narratives as to why they can't. You immature. You're a walking child. Grow up. You can be shown exactly what to do. The most successful people, like myself, because I'm on the path. I am going to I am going to help people. I am going to change people's lives. I am changing people's lives. Day by day, increment by increment. It's happening. It's unfolding. But the point is that you need to be able to go on your own frequency. You need to be able to be self-starting and rise up to that potential. No handouts, get it done. Mature, evolve. Stop waiting for other people to do the work. They're not gonna do it, that's childish. So let me ask you, what you gonna do? Huh? Look at yourself in the mirror, you fat sloppy motherfucker, yeah. How the hell did you get that way? Oh, you're not fat, you're not sloppy, you feel like I'm not talking to you because you skinny? No, I used to be the skinniest motherfucker on the block. How did you get that way? By not doing the work. 
by not showing up, by being a pleasure-seeking individual, right? So at the end of the day, what you need is to wake up. Break the false narrative. Stop expecting people to do the work. Man up, woman up, rise up to your human potential. Get the answers, right? Oh yeah, it just came back because y'all thought I lost the thought. As I'm on this way to deliver the answers to the people who really want to succeed, the main key that you must keep in mind is that the people who truly become, who truly manifest, who truly lean into the results that they want are the people who are like, give me the fucking answers. Just give me the answers. I just need the answers. I need these answers. You see what I'm saying? Everybody else who's out here acting all confused with these old, oh, I need the trainer with me, still don't get no results, I need somebody to walk with me, I need my hand held, all that. Yeah, you're never going to make it. You're never going to make it with that mindset. The only mindset is to get the answers and get the results. Period. You need motivation. You got kids. You need motivation. What about that feeling you get when you look in the mirror knowing that you look like shit? What about that feeling you get when you when you get high and you know you wanted to quit? Use that as motherfucking motivation. What about that feeling knowing that you got one life to live and you out here scared to be what you know you are being called to be? What about that feeling, huh? You like that? You, you, you like that? You must love that shit. Fucking bitch. Yo, listen. I love y'all. And the intention is always to wake you up to your higher calling. Coming out with that soft, spiritual whop -a whoop Yeah, I could talk very delicately. And I'm highly compassionate. But there's a time and a place for the compassion. And there's a time and a place for you to just get this real shit. You heard? Whatever you are, your world is yours. Consider the vibrations raised. I could give you and show you exactly what you need to know. You need to want to know it, you need to want to grow, and you need to apply the motherfucking teachings. And as you grow, you will see, your world will become yours, inch by inch, moment by moment, and increment by increment. Stay blessed, y'all. Your world is yours, 100%. Consider the vibrations raised. Mindset. Mindset. There ain't no more fucking workout. The workout is basic. The workout's gonna show me who your mind look like. Are you going to be able to stick to the fucking plan? Simple. It's food and the workout. That's it. You can't even stick to that? The fuck you think you're going to be successful as an entrepreneur in this world? You tripping. Can't even manage your own self. Let's work. Give you a safe space to grow forward. I'm not even going to say fail. Grow. Whatever you are, your world is yours. I love you enough to talk to you like this. I'm not going to lie. I'm not walking around like that. Need motivation? Watch this video again, and again, and again, and watch all our other videos. Your world is yours, or is it? Consider the vibrations raised.